This year, amid the emergence of numerous AI products, the Tesla Optimus robot is set to become the next major focal point of this revolution. It has generated significant buzz and sparked numerous discussions about the benefits and potential dangers of humanoid robots. While most people eagerly anticipate its usefulness in assisting humans with tedious and hazardous tasks, others worry that these machines might take away jobs or, in a more extreme scenario, even pose a threat to humans. The concept of robots replacing humans may cause some anxiety, but Elon Musk has reassured the public that Tesla will not follow the path of the Terminator. Instead, Musk believes that Optimus will become the world's safest homemaker. In its initial phase, it may be capable of fewer tasks due to incomplete data collection, but eventually Optimus will be able to perform most tasks once it reaches customers. With each upgrade, the number of tasks it can handle and its dexterity will continue to improve. Ultimately, it could carry out nearly any job we can imagine. 500 or even 1,000 tasks would be effortless. Keep in mind that robots require very little rest. They don't get tired. However, Optimus will undoubtedly face strong competition as more companies introduce humanoid robots with impressive abilities and dexterity. So, what can the Tesla bot do compared to its rivals? Why is Tesla investing so heavily in it instead of electric cars? Welcome to Tesla Car World. Let's be honest, have you ever really thought about asking a robot to help you with a task? It still sounds like a far-off idea, doesn't it? In reality, most humanoid robots on the market today are slow, clumsy, and don't seem to offer much practical value. Some people even see them as little more than walking piles of scrap metal, rather than intelligent machines worth tens of thousands of dollars. But if you pay attention, you'll notice something interesting. Over the past two years, the world has suddenly become fascinated with humanoid robots. From China to North America, tech companies are racing into this field with the ambition of turning science fiction into reality. In North America, Boston Dynamics has long been regarded as the king of the robotics world, with cutting-edge creations like SpotDog, Stretch Robot, and Atlas Robot. However, there's one undeniable fact. None of Boston Dynamics robots have been mass-produced. For nearly a decade, they have remained advanced prototypes, never truly integrating into our everyday lives. This has led many to believe that humanoid robots are still just a distant dream, a vision stuck in labs and factories rather than appearing in our homes. This was our perspective a few years ago when humanoid robots only existed in movies. However, after seeing the advancements of Tesla Bot and other humanoid robots, our view has completely changed. What if, in just two years, it becomes perfectly normal to see a robot receiving packages, folding clothes, packing goods in a shopping center, or even serving drinks and food at McDonald's or Pizza Hut? Yeah, you heard that right. Like in 2026, it's, it's really the kind of thing where you, you could tell it to do kind of a, a wide range of tasks. Since the end of last year, you may have noticed that Optimus has appeared less frequently or released fewer update videos. This has sparked rumors that Optimus might have died before it could even launch. However, that is not the case. We acknowledge that over the past three months, Tesla has reduced the frequency of update videos about the Optimus humanoid robot. The most notable recent update was in December 2024, when Elon Musk shared a video showcasing Optimus's ability to navigate rough terrain. The limitation in public sharing may stem from Tesla's internal strategy. Elon Musk previously revealed plans to deploy humanoid robots internally within the company in 2025 and expand to commercial sales in 2026, with production potentially reaching 100,000 Optimus units by then. This suggests that Tesla may be focusing on refining and testing Optimus in real-world environments before making widespread announcements. The robot could be used for factory cleaning, transporting goods, organizing batteries, or even assisting in electric vehicle manufacturing processes. There are truly many potential tasks. Restricting public information also helps Tesla protect its technology and development strategy from competitors. During the internal testing phase, maintaining secrecy can prevent other companies from copying or developing similar products, safeguarding Tesla's competitive edge in the humanoid robotics market. This is particularly relevant to China, which is known for its agility in replicating technology. You may not know this, but Optimus has a highly promising future thanks to its always connected capability. Optimus is not just an internet-connected device like a smartphone. It can take actions, learn, 
and interact with other robots as well as Tesla's cloud system. Looking at the evolution of networks from the 1970s to today, we can see the convergence of the Internet era and the wireless revolution. Initially, people could only access the Internet through wired connections, but with the introduction of the iPhone in 2007, mobile networks exploded. Today, Optimus is designed to leverage the widespread availability of network connectivity, allowing it to communicate with other robots, Tesla's cloud system, and the Internet to access various services. Another key factor is the integration of Optimus with Starlink, SpaceX's satellite system. Starlink ensures that Optimus can operate even in remote areas where there is no cellular signal or Wi-Fi. More importantly, with Starlink's direct-to-cell technology, Optimus can connect directly to satellites without needing traditional network infrastructure. This opens up possibilities for using Optimus anywhere, from remote regions and airplanes to ships in areas without conventional network infrastructure. Optimus is not just a connected robot, it features a groundbreaking capability, mobile and shared memory. Every interaction, from voice and images to actions, is recorded and synchronized in real time with Tesla's cloud system. This allows users to access Optimus's entire data history through a mobile app, enabling seamless interaction with the robot, even when it is not physically present. More importantly, if an Optimus unit encounters an issue or requires maintenance, its data can be transferred to another Optimus, ensuring that no information is lost and allowing for an uninterrupted user experience. For businesses operating multiple Optimus robots, the ability to share memory between devices offers exceptional benefits. Imagine a restaurant where multiple Optimus units are working together. When one Optimus robot learns a new task, that knowledge is instantly shared with all other robots without the need for individual reprogramming. This not only boosts operational efficiency, but also creates a synchronized, intelligent, and highly adaptive robotic system. Interestingly, if you own multiple stores, you can purchase more than one Optimus. In fact, you could buy a large number of robots if their price truly drops to $20,000, as Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized. Of course, this won't happen at launch. That price point will only be achieved when Tesla produces 1 million Optimus units per year. A more realistic expectation is that the initial price will be around $45,000 to $60,000. However, as we've mentioned before, Optimus can generate profits quickly if businesses know how to leverage its capabilities. This is why Elon Musk believes every company will want an army of Optimus robots. Since TeslaBot operates as a unified system, owning multiple Optimus units allows them to assign tasks to one another, optimizing operations across different departments or store locations. This means the more robots you have, the better. For example, if you deploy an Optimus in a store in Texas, it can send tasks to another Optimus in a New York store to complete a job. All units are interconnected and learn from each other. Your robots can exchange private information with trusted Optimus units, enhancing efficiency compared to other robot providers, which might struggle with data synchronization or technical connectivity issues. As Elon Musk has revealed, Tesla Bot will also be available for lease rather than requiring a large upfront payment. This benefits customers by allowing them to test Optimus with a smaller investment before deciding if it's a good fit for their business. If companies adopt Optimus at scale, Tesla may offer options to purchase or lease robots in groups or small teams. A business manager could train one Optimus with a specific skill set, then replicate that skill set across all other robots in their group. While these skills might be uploaded to Tesla's cloud, they will be marked as belonging to the company that developed them. This means that if a business decides to buy additional Optimus units in the future, the new robots will already have those trained skills, eliminating the need for retraining. This is just like FSD on Tesla EVs. From our perspective, when you deploy a large-scale fleet of Tesla robots, they form a massive computing system capable of handling tasks that a single AI alone could not manage. As Optimus reaches higher levels of refinement and receives continuous upgrades, these Tesla bots could take on more than 1,000 different tasks, and that number is still growing. Elon Musk isn't just making empty promises. He has repeatedly stated that Optimus will walk among humans and become an integral part of everyday life. Imagine a world where every household owns at least one Optimus, possibly even more. Recently, Musk even emphasized that Optimus will be like having your own C-3PO and R2-D2. If you're a Star Wars fan, 
you'll know that Anakin Skywalker built C-3PO as a child to help his mother with housework. That's precisely why Musk created Optimus a reliable assistant that can handle household chores but is far more powerful than C-3PO. What makes Optimus even more remarkable is that, if used wisely, it could even help you generate income, turning it into a profitable investment rather than just a support tool. Musk has mentioned thousands of potential tasks that Tesla's humanoid robot could perform, and that number has already surpassed 1,000. But this is just the beginning. With each software update, Optimus could expand its capabilities to 5,000 or even 10,000 different tasks. Imagine that at first it can only cook 10 dishes, but with every update, it learns 50 more. Eventually, it could prepare any dish you desire as long as you provide the ingredients. Of course, this level of sophistication will take time. For now, in 2025, Tesla Bot will primarily be used in Tesla's factories. As we predicted, when Tesla deploys Optimus in the production process, they will also maximize the connectivity of humanoid robots. One Optimus can hand over a task to another, or multiple Optimus units can work together without direct communication, simply by connecting through a network. Another example is when Optimus robots are assigned to guard a warehouse at night. Even without direct contact, they can still function as a unified team thanks to network connectivity. This is truly impressive when you think about it. So far, we believe that the Tesla bot is the most aesthetically pleasing humanoid robot on the market. It has given us quite a friendly and engaging impression since its launch. By that, we mean Tesla has designed it to look less like a Terminator. When placed alongside competitors, the difference is striking. While many other robots still expose wiring, bulky metal frames, and rough technical details, Optimus boasts a seamless, sophisticated design with virtually no visible flaws, almost to an unbelievable extent. In our view, the only improvement Optimus might need right now or in a future high-end Gen 3 version is a display screen on the front, which could help it communicate more visually with humans. However, this is just a personal opinion. For Tesla, such an addition might not be necessary, as they always prioritize efficiency and production costs. Moreover, an upgrade like this could complicate research and drive the price above the initially projected $20,000. Many have jokingly said that Tesla Optimus walks like Joe Biden, or as if it just finished an intense leg workout. But if you look closely, you'll notice that not only Optimus, but also humanoid robots from Boston Dynamics, Unitree and Kepler Forerunner all have a slightly bent knee gait. This is not a random design choice, it is a deliberate engineering decision. When a robot maintains a slightly hunched posture with bent knees, its center of gravity is lowered, enhancing stability and balance while in motion. This is especially crucial when dealing with sudden positional changes or navigating uneven terrain. Tesla Optimus adopts this stance not only to maintain stability, but also to optimize energy consumption. By reducing the torque required for knee joints, the robot can move more efficiently without consuming excessive power. Therefore, instead of criticizing Optimus's somewhat stiff gait, we should focus on a more important issue, its movement speed and overall performance, which have yet to be truly impressive. So, is Optimus one of the slowest moving humanoid robots today? The answer is yes. With a maximum speed of only about one meter per second, Optimus is significantly slower than its competitors which can reach speeds of up to 2 meters per second. In test videos, Optimus takes 132 steps in 78 seconds, averaging 1.67 steps per second, with a stride length slightly over one foot. Clearly, this is a major drawback in terms of Optimus's competitiveness, especially since most customers, including us, expect a robot with more agile movement. That's why we strongly hope to see a breakthrough in Optimus's speed in future upgrades. In recent times, we have also taken the time to observe other humanoid robots alongside the Tesla bot. Among them, we have truly noticed that figure AI is making astonishingly rapid progress. Recently, an image of a truck loaded with humanoid robots from figure AI has garnered attention, along with impressive operations that are on par with Tesla Optimus. Figure AI, a Silicon Valley-based startup, is quickly emerging as one of the leading names in the humanoid robotics field. Their flagship product, Figure 02, has begun deployment in industrial environments to perform logistics tasks. With the support of the company's self-developed Helix AI system, Figure 02 is demonstrating outstanding potential in automating and optimizing warehouse operations. Recently, Figure AI released a video showcasing Figure 02 robots sorting goods in an undisclosed warehouse. 
Founder and CEO Brett Adcock emphasized on social media that it took only 30 days to deploy these robots for the company's second customer. While the client's identity remains undisclosed, many experts speculate that it could be giant retail corporations such as Amazon or Walmart. Adcock believes that, with this new contract, the company could achieve its goal of producing 100,000 robots within the next four years. In the demo video, Figure 02 showcased its ability to recognize and sort packages using an advanced camera system. It can scan barcodes, locate objects, and self-correct errors. Notably, Helix AI enabled the robots to switch to sports mode, increasing operational speed by 50% and enhancing work efficiency. One of Figure 02's key strengths is its 3D depth perception. The robot's head-mounted camera can capture both fine details and wide-angle views, optimizing control precision. Moreover, the robot can self-check and calibrate its body components, minimizing downtime and maintaining stable performance across multiple units. This is particularly crucial for businesses deploying large fleets of robots. Helix AI technology not only helps individual robots operate efficiently, but also optimizes learning and knowledge sharing among them. When one robot learns a new skill, its control policies can be transferred to other robots without requiring recalibration, significantly reducing deployment time and effort. This gives Figure AI a major advantage over competitors in the market. After ending its partnership with OpenAI, Figure AI announced its own in-house AI system and is currently in the process of raising funds for its Series C round, aiming to secure $1.5 billion. If successful, the company's valuation could reach nearly $40 billion, a significant jump from $2.6 billion in 2024. In the future, Figure AI plans to introduce Figure 02 robots to the consumer market after refining them in industrial environments. The Helix AI technology, operating on low-power GPUs, is the key to expanding humanoid robots' applications into everyday life. Figure A I has made it clear that the role of a homemaker should be the top priority for humanoid robots. While exciting, this is a highly challenging and complex scenario for testing such training models. For example, teaching robots to perform intricate kitchen tasks would expose them to a wide range of actions across different contexts requiring extensive data collection. Above all, Elon Musk cannot underestimate any competitor, as this is no longer just the electric vehicle industry. While Tesla has a strong foundation and many advantages in manufacturing humanoid robots, its rivals are also achieving significant breakthroughs. Moreover, Tesla will undoubtedly face increasing competition as Google heavily invests in Aptronic and tech giants like Apple, OpenAI, and Meta are reportedly planning to enter the market.